As an organ, the skin or integumentary system is very important. It has many structural and functional properties. Let's start with going through some skin microanatomy. The skin is made up of many layers of cells and tissues. The three main layers that you may know are the epidermis, dermis, and hypodermis. The epidermis is the most superficial layer and it is made up of keratinized stratified squamous epithelium. This layer is self-renewing. It doesn't have any blood vessels but contains other cells for pigmentation, sensory nerves, and protection from trauma, fluid loss, bacteria, toxins, ultraviolet radiation, and temperature extremes. The dermis is known as the core of the integumentary system. It contains blood vessels, nerves, and sensory structures, lymph, hair follicles, and sweat glands. The papillary layer of the dermis contains loose areolar connective tissue, while the reticular layer is made up of a dense meshwork of fibers. Elastin fibers give the skin elasticity for movement and collagen fibers for structure and tensile strength. The hypodermis is the deepest layer and it lies below the dermis. It contains structures such as nerves, blood vessels, and adipose tissue, which are essential for the survival of the epidermis. It also serves as a border between the skin and underlying fascia, which is connected to bones and muscles. To learn more, check out our skin microanatomy model in Complete Anatomy.